Theater Rhythm is a fun, cute, adorable romp through 385 tracks, spanning across every single Final Fantasy game that has ever existed. It's also a fantastic rhythm game with challenge for those who want it, and ease for those who just want to tune out the world while listening to incredible songs from one of the most timeless series ever made. And sure, I am sort of playing it for those reasons. No, see, I'm playing it because I have to be good at rhythm games after 10 years of being told that singers can't count. So fuck you, maestro, I'm good at theater rhythm. <clears throat> Anyway, Final Fantasy was the first series I ever obsessed over as a kid. I think it was like seventh grade, a guy I knew brought over Final Fantasy VII and suddenly I was literally obsessed. I watched as the high wind flew across the open world and it felt like something I had never experienced before. I asked if I could borrow the game and no life the shit out of it. I'll never forget when I was absolutely demolishing Bizarro Sephiroth, only for one winged angel to start up as Safer Sephiroth stared into my child soul. My mom yelling at me to turn off my PlayStation because because it was time for dinner. Yes, it still haunts me. Or absolutely loving the music of Final Fantasy VIII and absolutely hating the junction system. Loving the first two discs, actually, and getting stuck at the second Ultimisia form. Only for me to let some rando borrow it for whatever reason my child brain decided that was okay, and they destroyed my disc four. What? I never have finished Final Fantasy VIII to this day. Christmas, when I received Final Fantasy IX. A game that went back to the roots of Final Fantasy. Roots that I had never even experienced. And to this day, Mike, have I lost you? I lost you. <sighs> Dude, Marco, you were supposed to talk about why people might love this game, not your personal history and how important and meaningful Final Fantasy has been to your entire life, basically, and how you became an opera singer because of Nobuo Uematsu and the music and, and how you fell in love with classical music and you listen, used to listen to classical piano CDs all the time to the point that you actually burned one of them because you listened to it so much that you actually like- <sighs> There I go again. Yeah, this game is an absolute nostalgia bomb. It's awesome. If you love Final Fantasy at all, this game is made for you. Period. If you don't like Final Fantasy, this game will absolutely not change your opinion on that at all. And yeah, if you like rhythm games, you'll definitely like this one. It's complex, but not absurdly difficult to learn, and the music slaps, if it wasn't obvious by now. This is absolutely a love letter to Final Fantasy. The art style oozes adorable from your character sprites to the cuddly villains you fight. Not only that, but you can mix and match your party from literally a hundred plus characters from different Final Fantasies. Now that's fan service. It's a happy game. We need more of these. I think you'll love it. Fan of the series or not. In fact, if you don't even know about Final Fantasy, I say screw it. Make this your first foray into the series. There's nothing cooler to me than hearing music out of context for the first time and then actually seeing what it's like in context and seeing if it's like you thought it would be. I highly recommend this game. It is absolutely a blast. I definitely have nostalgia glasses on, but honestly, it's a really fun game. I'm really excited to play this for the next several months. If you like this sort of stuff, feel free to like, subscribe. There's a ton of videos about Final Fantasy on this channel, and I'll talk to you later.